Hi, and welcome to the Bed Lab. Lesson number three. In this tutorial, I will teach you how to use the flame of a candle to build a candle MIDI controller. To do that, we'll need a Wiimote, a candle, oscillator, and a software that you usually use that can accept MIDI controls. Ableton Live, Module 8, and many others. Let's get started. Today we're gonna learn how to modify your sound with fire. I will use a candle and a Wiimote again. The Wiimote in this setup is attached to a mic stand like this. Inside the Wiimote there's an infrared webcam that can read infrared sources like lighter for example. Okay let's get started. The first thing I want to do is open Osculator and connect the Wiimote pressing the 1 and 2 button together. Okay, it's working and we want to use the RAW IR and light up a candle. Okay, now we can see that something is happening here. Okay, and we can check if it's working with a quick look. So we want to select the message and hit quick look and we can see that it's working so smooth and in a second I can see the other axis too. Okay, we have two working axes. We have one more which is the size but it's a little bit glitchy. Let's see what it does. But we can maybe use it in some crazy plugin. Okay, so the thing I want to do now is to assign a MIDI CC value to each of these. So let's say MIDI CC, MIDI CC 0 and 1. Now I want to open my software. Okay, now we can put a sound, create a clip. Plate. Okay, it's working. So now what we want to do is to control and modify the sound with candles. Okay, to do that we want to solo one parameter, pressing Command R, and choose, let's say, the volume here in Ableton Live and you see it's already mapped. Now I have the volume on this axis. Wow, working in no time. Okay, now let's assign another control. Let's say to a knob. I want to solo the other axis and I want to try the pitch knob. So I edit my MIDI map and it's mapped again. So now when I move on Y axis the pitch moves and the volume not because I have to enable it here. Okay, the pitch and the volume. Let's hear how it sounds. <laughs> Fun. Fun and easy. But the cool thing is that one Wii mode can accept up to four infrared sources. Now I can add another candle and control more things. Let's switch to Osculator again. Now we can see that something is happening here in the second infrared control. I want to assign a MIDI CC here too. And channel 2, 3, the first free slot. And I want to solo the message. And I want to go back to Ableton Live select another knob and MIDI map working 
Okay, now I have two candles working. Okay, I have to turn on this again. Now I have two candles working. Really smooth, modifying the sound. Imagine what you can do with four candles. Be creative, use your imagination and connect more remotes, so more candles. You can connect up to four remotes to one laptop. Have fun and write some comments. If you want a more in-depth tutorial, uh, let me know. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, please, and like the video and keep the channel going. Thanks, see you next time, bye. Please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to visit my website www.bedinstruments.com Thank you! Bad, bad.